East Sydney Academy of Art is an artistic oasis in the middle of the city. It is a great place to unwind after work and explore your artistic creativity in a friendly bohemian studio. It is located centrally in William Street, just a stone's throw from the famous Coca-Cola sign at King's Cross. It is our little yellow house amongst the bigger buildings. Downstairs is a wonderful art gallery and the school entrance is beside a hock shop full of interesting nicks and knacks. The number 189 is in big letters above the entranceway. The nearest railway station is just up the hill at King's Cross. Watson's Bay to Circular Quay buses go right past the door. While Town Hall, Museum and St James stations are just 10 minutes walk away. Metered parking is found in William Street and timed parking in side streets nearby. Once at our yellow house, proceed up the stairs if the entrance is open. If you are early, it might be closed while we prepare for class. Outside class hours, the school is normally closed because it is Tony's professional art studio and he needs the privacy to get his own artwork done. Once inside, you will discover a bohemian world of sculpture, paintings and books. From the ceiling, Icarus welcomes you. The studio is like an exotic art gallery and you will be inspired by your surroundings as you learn to draw and paint. Beginners learn alongside very experienced artists and advanced students. Thus you will see the results of the school's teachings in action. You will find your fellow students are warm and welcoming and their artworks very inspirational. They are happy to help newcomers as you settle into the class. The only art materials required at first are cartridge paper, charcoal and a kneaded eraser. The charcoal should be natural willow charcoal and the best kind of kneaded erasers are the cheaper bluish grey ones found in most newsagents and art stores. You may bring your own art supplies to class or if you prefer there are all needed basic art materials for sale at the art class. Teaching methods at the school are loosely based on the ideas of Leonardo da Vinci, who was the first artist to write about art education in the modern sense of the words. He was an active experimenter as well as a theorist, whose sense of rhythm and movement in his drawings and his search to find the poetic life beyond the surface of things continues to inspire. As was Leonardo's way, all art at East Sydney Academy of Art starts with the study of the human figure. This begins with a classical approach to skills that become the basis for creative experimentation. Anatomy and proportion are tools that inform the understanding of exactly what we are seeing. Understanding liberates creativity and informs our poetic sensitivity. Although the starting point is traditional charcoal and then red chalk, the goal is the exploration of various media in the search for the expression that best suits your individual artistic sensitivity. The teaching methodology of the school revolves around practical drawing and painting skills. The human figure is the most interesting subject of all to draw 
and it is the key to all the artistic fundamentals that are then applied to more complex ideas and subjects. Besides practical drawing and observation of the figure, classes also include demonstrations, both individually and in groups. Students are encouraged to talk about their work and their progress. They are encouraged to ask questions about how to make something look like they want it to look. Classes feature talks and group discussions that range from the appreciation of art history and artists, both past and present, to practical issues such as goal setting and how to deal with basics like rhythm in art, proportions, anatomy and so on. Both beginners and advanced students benefit from the richness of this comprehensive approach. <laughs> the school has all necessary equipment and facilities to help your learning experience. Easels, drawing boards and clips are all provided. There is a skeleton and skulls to study and draw, as well as traditional casts a favourite teaching method of the old masters. And there is a well-stocked library of art history books for study and reference. Printmaking presses include a magnificent antique. This very rare French oak press is 150 years old. Students work in a studio surrounded by paintings and sculpture and all the tools of a modern working studio. Although the collection of pigments and paint making supplies reaches back to the traditions and skills of the old masters. East Sydney Academy of Art is a great place to unwind, learn and follow the artistic path walked by creative people in centuries past and now and into the future. I passionately believe that everyone can learn to draw and paint given time and encouragement. Individuals vary a great deal in their reasons for making art and whether your goal is simply to enjoy escaping from the world into bohemian artistry for a few hours or if you have a passion to invent entire new art forms that no one else has seen before, you will discover that you are very welcome in the bohemian world of East Sydney Academy of Arts.